Hello and welcome to a very passionate football venue. I'm talking, of course, about Elland Road. I'm Derek Ray, and ready with his tactics board alongside me is Stuart Robson, my commentary partner. I'm looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League coming right up. It's Leeds United up against Aston Villa. Yes, thanks as always, Derek. We've got two good teams here, so I'm anticipating a really good game. The atmosphere is electric inside the stadium before kickoff, and hopefully we're not disappointed. Well, you never quite know who's going to emerge from the shadows and become a match winner, but this man might be a decent shout. What are you expecting to see from him, Stuart? I would describe him as majestic when he's playing at his best. He glides past defenders, he's got that ability to run with the ball into open space, he can pick out a pass, he can wriggle out of tight situations. He's the most creative player on the field today. And a look at the starting 11 for Leeds United. Well, they're starting with an attacking 4-5-1 formation with three players in advance of two holding midfielders. But it's important that the wide players come in field to join the centre forward at the right time. Here's how the lineup looks for Aston Villa. Emilio Martinez is the goalkeeper. Tyrone Mings plays alongside Ezri Konza in central defence. Coutinho plays with Leon Bailey in the wide areas. And leading the line today is Ollie Watkins. And this confrontation is underway. Mark Rocca. Adams. Now with Koch. Sinistera. The attack continues. They're making considerable progress, but quick thinking defensively. It looks promising. Well, he's been ruled offside. Mark Rocca. Well read to put an end to that attack. Sound piece of goalkeeping. Tyler Adams. Luis Sinistera. Lovely work to get past his man. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Out of play then for a Villa throw in. Bubakar Kamara. Good vision. Can he get onto this? And still pressing. Coutinho, credit to them for winning back possession. Good looking ball, there could be a chance now. But the flag goes up, offside. Well, he just needs to play that a bit sooner. The pass was definitely on. A good looking ball in behind and tossing through and there it is the breakthrough that will do nicely
Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace in transition. They're so quick to get out from the back, and once he gets onto it, he just smashes it past the keeper with great technique. What an emphatic finish that is. And the ball moving again. What sort of response will we see from them now? John McGinn. Oh, a nice looking pass. Well, it still could be dangerous. Coutinho. Can he find the net? And no way through. Mark Rocca. On the ball, Mark Rocca. Committed challenge. Well, half time coming up shortly, and the home side on top. Stuart, interested to get your critique. Well, it's been a tight game so far, but they've just had that little bit more quality on the ball, particularly in midfield, where they've just started to take control. They'll be fairly happy going at half time if it stays like this. Watkins. And a lead throw forthcoming. Tyler Adams. Luis Sinistera. Well, sitting deep like this might be a dangerous game. Mastery of the passing game. Watkins. Difficult to stop him. McGinn. Now well, able to close down the shot. Played over. And the keeper making sure that was pushed well away from danger. And that is going to be all for the first 45 here at Elland Road. Well, such is the lot of an attacking player. Some days it works for you, on other days, not at all, Stuart. Yeah, he's just not found his form today. He doesn't look quite right. Unless he can impose himself on this game and start threatening the keeper, they're going to lose this one. So back underway here into the second half. Under pressure, doesn't seem to be bothering him. Mark Rocca. Brendan Aronson. Can they create something from here? And they need to get tighter here. And Leeds have the throw. And a substitution in the offing. Go, go. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. And showing fine vision. again Wendia Bailey just the clearance that was called for 
Well, Leeds aren't controlling the possession here, but when they have won it back in midfield areas, their counter-attacking has been excellent. They'll be happy with the way the game's going at the moment. Yes, really good without the ball, and the all-around performance levels have been high. Top-class defending. Wendia. This might have potential. Watkins. Really vital interception here. And space to exploit, maybe. Can he play it in? Well, they have the ball once more. Showing plenty of defensive acumen and conceding the throw in. And the substitution will occur now. Teammates in the middle. Well, the keeper wasn't fooled by it at all, in actual fact. 20 minutes to go in this one. Ings. There to take it away. Now, what can they do from here? Oh, big opportunity! Surely! They've gone and scored again. They're doing everything in their power to make sure they're not pegged back. Well, as you can see, he hits this with so much power. But just look at the follow-through. So athletic. That's a dynamic strike. And the ball is moving again. 2 0 is how it stands. Dinia. And now Bailey. McGinn. And back with Bailey. Danny Ings. And now with McGinn. And a really good diving stop. So two substitutes to come on in one go. Number 21, And number eight, Mark Rother. Coming onto the pitch. Number six, Liam Cooper. And number two, Luke Ailey. Well, the short corner routine. A fine block. Favouring the short one. Dinia. Mings. Good use of advantage by the referee. Well, he's got plenty of space on the flank here. Gives it a go. And the keeper taking care of the situation. McGinn. Bubakar Kamara. Well, taking into account all the stoppages, three minutes to be added on. Might be able to get in behind the defence. Coutinho. Danny Ings. He takes aim. And the keeper showing tremendous command. So deciding to make a personnel change at this juncture. Coming onto the pitch. Number six, Douglas And the corner has been given. Can he deliver it with accuracy? Oh, there it is! A lifeline in this game! And what a finale we could be in for here!
Well, here you can see it again. It's a superb cross, just asking for someone to go and meet it. And it's a comfortable finish in the end, which is made to look so easy. It's a lovely goal. And there goes the final whistle. Job done by Leeds United today. What did you make of it? Well, Derek, it was a tight game. Both sides had their moments and chances, but overall, they just about shaded it. A well-earned victory. His performance in this particular game will have impressed many people, Stuart. Yeah, not much more you could ask for, really. Plenty of effort, a goal, and most importantly, the right result. He should be happy with today.